Thatcham is the Motor Insurance Research Centre. We've been in business for over 44 years now and our purpose is to help insurers reduce claim costs and more accurately underwrite their policies by researching vehicles particularly relating to the safety capabilities, the security of cars and crucially the repairability and how much a car is damaged uh, during an accident. We're at a very important time in vehicle development. The development of new cars is moving incredibly fast and the manufacturers are delivering cars that are highly capable of driving themselves um, in the years that come. Thatcham's role is to evaluate these systems and to influence the vehicle manufacturers to bring the most effective systems to market. Thatcham's been a member of Euro NCAP for 10 years, working with the vehicle manufacturers, testing their vehicles to improve vehicle safety as they strive for that coveted five stars. For us, the insurance group rating is important. I think insurance is one of those things that a little bit of a distress purchase, people don't really want to buy it. Um, but on the basis they have to buy it, it's as important as the vehicle price uh, overall. One of the other things is critically important around parts pricing. So we'll work closely uh, with our parts supply teams in Munich and with the team at Thatcham to establish what's the right market price for those let's say bumper parts or headlamp parts or whatever, uh, to ensure that we get an optimum group rating. So Thatcham has a unique data set of research that's been built up over the years. It's used by many different parties, by vehicle manufacturers, by repair sector in the UK and abroad, and by consumers through motor magazines printing some of the data and by insurers using the group ratings data, for example. So a rich data set that has a massive impact, not just in the UK, but worldwide too. Thatcham delivers the methods around the country through an online access system called eScribe. It's an online uh, workshop manual for repairing cars. Access to Thatcham and the eScribe product enable us to respond very quickly and within a short period of time we can have the information we need thus cutting the cycle time down for the insurer which of course is value to them. Particularly of, uh, of recent times with uh, the BMW i3 in terms of a lot of new materials on this car, a lot of carbon fibre, we've worked absolutely collaboratively in terms of getting the best repair methods and I think yeah, the team from Thatcham have worked really well with our engineers in Munich to establish how should we go about repairing this car in a real life accident repair situation. So you've just seen an autonomous emergency braking system, an AEB system in action. This vehicle is fitted with autonomous emergency braking. With half a million whiplash injuries in the UK every year, this system can avoid those crashes. It uses lasers and a camera and radar and it automatically monitors the chance of having a crash. The next generation of technologies are going to reduce other crash types like parking crashes, high speed crashes, intersection and also protect vulnerable road users. This will make our roads safer and further reduce claims. So all our work here at Thatcham is focused on improving safety, security and the repairability of vehicles, all with the sole purpose of driving down insurance claims costs. Now we think the value of that research in 2012 alone was some £500 million in avoided costs for motor insurers. And when you consider some of the exciting new technologies that we're currently researching, such as autonomous emergency braking, that value can increase to a billion pounds in just five years. Now to put that in context, that's the equivalent of about 50 pounds of the average annual motor insurance premium. So our focus will be very much on researching those emerging technologies that will really have the major impact on claims costs. So that's where Thatcham will continue its research with the sole aim of delivering value to insurers and to UK drivers.